we're going to look at how to export again in a much more complicated scene. So I'm going to show you how to export one model at a time. If I just click on, let's do the, let's do this diagonal brick right here. I just had the diagonal brick highlighted and I'm going to go up here to the file menu export. It should default to the F3D fusion 3D. That's what I want submitted and give it whatever name you want. It right here has the name of the file, not the name of what I have highlighted. You will probably want to put it in your downloads directory and hit export. All right, if you did that, however, all it's going to do is export just this diagonal brick. What you need to do is make sure the top layer up here is clicked. I'll click off it and click on it again. You can see everything right here is highlighted and then you can go export and this should give you everything. Again, it really depends on what you have highlighted and then you need to hit export. So if I just want to export a wheel, no problem. Just click the wheel and you can also right click and go export. That's another option. Uh, if you do that, make sure that you don't save to your computer, you save to the cloud and I'll show you exactly what's going to happen. I'll save this to the cloud. It should show up right here in a second. And then I'm going to go ahead and export the whole thing. So again, I got the top level selected and I'm going to go export and save in a cloud right here. <clears throat> oh, let's give it a different name. Now over here in the cloud, this does say wheel right here. So let's go ahead and open up wheel and see what we're looking at. And then you're going to see all it is just the tire and the rim that made up that wheel. I don't know what happened, but I exported everything here. Let's try that again. You can also, if you want, export right here. Um, I haven't made it invisible. You could make it visible again. You can decide maybe I want to export all the bricks or the layout right here. So if I want to export the layout, you go export. It's already called brick layout. I'll save it to the cloud right here. And you will want to save it to your computer to turn it in. So there's a brick layout just showed up and now I think I can export the top here. I've clicked all the way on the top export. It should have the same name as your project here. I'm going to save it in the cloud. I'm going to skip saving my computer and it should show up. So we're going to check out all these different ones. Here's the brick layout fusion file. It's got everything in the brick layout here. Let's see, the extra brick had the other layout. So it just all depends on what you have selected when you click export. And of course, you're going to want to save all these on your computer so you can turn them in.